This man, Sidney Cooper, groped a journalist, a prosecutor, and female prison officers. These facts, coupled with a shocking spike in sex crimes against women and girls, have raised alarm in the Bahamas. National Security Minister Wayne Monroe did the uncommon last week, but he did what the law allows. He outed a prolific sex offender hours before that man was turned out of the Fox Hill prison. That provides for public notification of the release of sexual offenders on the register by the minister. I've made a determination that I should notify the public of the release of inmate Sidney Cooper. The man is described as a serial rapist, not rehabilitated and mentally disturbed. Someone who should be incarcerated because he poses such a threat. But his time is up. He had to be released and over the weekend he was. Groped and indecently assaulted the female prosecutor in the court who was prosecuting him for that offense in the presence of the magistrate. Since he has been committed to the Bahamas Department of Corrections, he has groped and indecently assaulted correctional, female correctional officers and a reporter who was visiting to do a story. Monroe said Sidney Cooper is either unwilling or unable to control his criminal urges and on his exit interview shared his disturbing reasoning for repeatedly offending. Women invite him to touch them when they wear short clothes or wear tight clothes or smile or lick their lips or bend over or move their hips or blink their eyes across their legs. From the Bahamas, DeAndre Hamilton reporting.